The system is very well thought out and the logistics are excellent. The view expressed by National Security Minister Stuart Young during a visit to the Migrant Registration Center at the Queen's Park Oval on Thursday. He said he expects an increase in the number of Venezuelans going to register in the coming days. People would want to test the system. They want to become comfortable with the system. So one of the messages is all of those who have not as yet registered, please come out and utilize the registration process. It is for a limited period of time. We are shutting down the process on the 14th of June. Thereafter, as I've said on a number of occasions repeatedly, and I'll repeat it again now, come after the 14th of June, from the 15th of June, we revert to the laws of Trinidad and Tobago, and persons who are here illegally stand the consequences and the potential of being deported. Minister Young said his ministry will no longer be giving a daily report. Instead, he said citizens will receive a full report on the number of persons registered and the cost to the state at the end of the process. Minister Young had his first viewing of the registration process this morning after returning yesterday from his overseas trip with Prime Minister Dr. Keith Rowley. And Minister Young also responded to questions about the proposed threat of a hunger strike by inmates at the Immigration Detention Center. The National Security Minister said they're always looking for ways to improve, but conditions are nowhere near as inhumane as they're being made to appear. He said, in fact, he was pleasantly surprised by conditions at the IDC during a visit about a month ago. And Minister Young added that those being detained at the IDC for overstaying their time would also be allowed to participate in the registration process illegally or maybe overstaying etc they will be processed in the registration process if there are persons however who are the IEDC for performing acts of criminality well they're in a different category just because there's a registration process going this is not as we've said from day one it's not a get out of jail card this is not an amnesty from crime